After one year in the hot seat, Commissioner of Police Gary Griffith is not satisfied and wants to do more. Speaking at the weekly police media briefing, Commissioner Griffith outlined what the police service has achieved so far and gave a preview of what they want to do in his second year as the top cop. Ian Wayson reports. Making it clear this is not the Gary Griffith show, the Commissioner of Police praised the police service for their good work. He said he is determined to deal with the issues and not make excuses when dealing with crime. He said during his first year in charge, he was able to bring down the overtime wage bill by 66%, issue 1,500 firearm users' licenses, and bring closure to outstanding high-profile investigations. There was also a 9% reduction in violent crimes. But with that all said and done, is the Commissioner of Police satisfied by fulfilling his promise he gave last independence that in one year time we will have a better police service? I am never satisfied. I, I deem for perfection. So as much as I have done all that is possible, I intend to do much more. I wish I can do much more and I intend to do much more. As I said, this is not the Gary Griffith show. This is about trying to make this the best Trent Tobago police service ever. And that is my intention, that is my job, that is my mission. Looking ahead to his second year, the top cop said he wants more training for his officers. That training would include public relations. He also wants a construction of police headquarters. He wants to acquire new armored vehicles and new uniforms with utility belts. And he's also hoping the attitude of some members of the public would change. Many people, everybody wants me to, to deal with enforcing the law, but it must not affect them. And that has been a big problem in this country. It must not affect me. Do what must, must be done, but don't let it affect me. Do not, do not let it affect my political party. Don't let it affect my business. Don't let it affect my contracts. Don't let it affect my gangs. Commissioner Griffith also promised to work closely with the prison service as he acknowledged that 50 homicides this year were connected to persons behind bars. Ian Wayson, TTT News.